Please pause this video and answer the question before continuing. Okay, before we answer this question, I'd like to remind you of the general strategy for all sentence equivalence questions in case you'd like to review it. All right, on to the question. As we read the sentence here, several descriptive words and phrases should pop out. Of these words, the ones that appear to provide context include approved, opposed, and originally. Now, since the law was finally approved, the provisions must have helped the lawmakers overcome their opposition and become satisfied with the law. So for our prediction, let's use satisfied, which we'll write on our scratch paper next to the question number. Now we'll check our answer choices. First, we have espoused, which means supported. Now at first glance, this word seems like a good fit. However, it does not make sense in the order in which the sentence is written. While a lawmaker could espouse or support a provision, a provision cannot espouse or support a lawmaker. So we need to eliminate A. Next, we have mollified, which means appeased. This matches our prediction, so answer choice B is a great candidate. Now, belabored means dwelled on. Again, this answer does not make sense in the order in which the sentence is written. A lawmaker can belabor a provision, but a provision cannot belabor a lawmaker. Eliminate C. Next, we have sedated, which means to calm down. This seems like a good fit, so let's keep it for now. Next, we have placated, which means appeased. So answer choice E is a good fit as well. Finally, aggrandized means exaggerated. This answer is not supported by our descriptive words, so we'll eliminate F. At this point, we have three possible answers. But keep in mind that the two correct answers must create sentences with similar meanings. Now, all three of these words can mean to calm down. However, only answer choices B and E can have the alternate meaning of appeasing. And appeasing is what matches our prediction. Also consider the fact that answer choice D implies that the lawmakers were treated in some physical manner to make them calm down. But there isn't really enough evidence in the sense to suggest that the lawmakers were bothered to the point of requiring sedation. So we can eliminate D, which means the correct answers here are B and E.